The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. The teams then, Celta Vigo against Barcelona. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. Uh, ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Who else but Lionel Messi? I don't need to tell anyone what he's capable of. Some critics don't rate him as the best player on the planet. Um, that's because the Argentinian, for me, is on a different planet. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. And he thought he'd beaten the offside trap too. It's a good call. Rakitic gets his foot in there. PK. Roberto. And it's Dembele. Battles to win it back. PK. Pumps it upfield. Dembele. Looks like a good ball through. Barcelona get it back again. Wonderful quick feet. Busquets, Dembele gets it, and now what? Messi hits it. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Celta Vigo, yet to have a shot on target. No, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. And Titi. Oh, it's beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Oh, good interception. Sergio Busquets. And it's Dembele. It's a promising run he's making on the right. Early ball. Great early ball. Same can't be said for the finish. In this game, you're always striving to, to gain an advantage or produce a, a little surprise element to things, and the quicker the delivery, I think, the more chance you have, and they should have done better there. Hernandez passes it through. Some astute defending to ensure they got no further. Hernandez. It's a long pass towards the front. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Touch and go. Aren't they supposed to get the benefit? And it's Iniesta. Thrust towards the front line. Sergio Busquets. Roberto. Messi. There's a look to the possibilities, but in the end, it's fruitless. Iniesta knocks it towards the front. Rakitic gets it back. Sergio Busquets. Who's going to make this theirs? Messi. Still, rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. Messi's cross. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Hernandez tries to get it forward quickly. Now the pass. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. PK pumps it upfield. Jordi Alba looking to penetrate opposition lines. 
It's in! And grabbing that opening goal so close to half-time too affords them that extra little psychological edge. And when it's one of your main men that's doing the damage, it just grows the togetherness and it grows the spirit. Suarez just stayed on the right side of the defender there. I thought he showed wonderful patience, great experience to just make sure he didn't drift offside. And I just thought all around it was very intelligent play. But it'll be the final action of the first half. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half time because in truth they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. Celta Vigo don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first. If they don't grab an early goal in this second half, they can't hold back though. Luis Suarez with the ball through. Up for the header! He scored! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Great header, made it look easy. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. <laughs> Barcelona have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal is such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Sergio Busquets, and it's Luis Suarez. Goncalia sticks in a foot to win it back. TK was not to be moved. Dembele gets into the right position to intercept. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Luis Suarez. Now it's Messi. Top save! That shot was travelling. Looks to slip it through. It's anyone's ball. Spoon forward. Sergio Busquets already, of course, on the score sheet. Oh, he's broken through. Comes sliding in. Luis Suarez just doesn't give up. You just know he'll be in there again before long. Aimed long and direct. Has a pop! Clearance and very necessary. Oh, listen, I think you can understand at times that the pace of the game pressures players into split second decisions, and sometimes they just make the wrong one. And I think he would have been better placing that. Sergio Busquets gets it back. That was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Messi. And it's Luis Suarez. Jordi Alba needed to come up with a better ball. Well, he simply failed to just put a little more oomph behind that. Alex Vidal. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Messi. Iago Aspas tries the route one option. Moore pushes it out wide. In once more. Carries far too far and out of play. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and... and Who's going to make this theirs? Jordi Alba has created one goal already. Luis Suarez pings it out wide. Now the cross. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Tries a through ball. They are rampant! 
and the lead is three. It is surely done. Yeah, I love the finish, but I think had the pass been delayed for just a second longer, I think he would have been flagged offside, and I think you have to praise them all round on that one from the pass and the finish. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Jordi Alba gets it back. And it's Messi. Now the pass. Looks like a good ball through. Oh, wonderful, wonderful Lionel Messi! They are running riot here! What about that, Jim Beglin? Messi is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Barcelona tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. And TT. Jordi Alba. And TT. Iniesta. The final whistle. Celta Vigo thoroughly outclassed here. They came up against opponents who were better in all areas. No argument. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? I think they struggled to handle the high press from the opposition and were wasteful with the ball time and time again as a result. They really needed to pick up in that area. They didn't, and that's why it's got away from them. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.